Now you have to find x and y if x plus y is equal to pi 209 and x minus y is equal to 360 minus 1. Now we have x plus y and plus x minus y. Let us put this together. Okay. And put the matrices pi two zero nine and three six zero minus one. Okay. So that uh, you'll get here uh, this if you look at the signs plus y and minus y gets cancelled. So that I get 2x. Okay. Now let us uh, add this. 5 plus 3 will be 8. Okay. And 6 plus 2 will be? 8. 8. eight. Yeah. And next is? Zero. Zero. 0. Very good. Next is? 8. 8 again. Now I want x. Right. So? x is equal to half of 8808 8, 8. and then further if you simplify right so okay so you get x now as when you divide it you get as 4 4 0 you got the x value. Okay. So yes, let us now find y value. So let us find this by subtracting it. So let us put the value 5, 2, 0, 9 minus 3, 6, 0, minus 1. Right. Now when you subtract it, uh, these two gets cancelled. So you'll have 2y minus of minus plus. Okay. So 5 minus 3? 2. 2. Uh, 2 minus 6? Min minus 4. Minus 4. Good. And 0 and 9 zero. plus 9 plus 1? 9 plus 8, uh, 10. 10, yeah. So you get y value. Bring 2 on the other side. So this becomes 1 by 2. 2 minus 4, 0, 10. Okay. So please simplify this further. So after uh, simplifying it, we got the value of x and as well as y okay so now let us first multiply 2 okay okay so you get 2x and 10 10 14 14 2y minus 6 because 2 into y and minus 6 right mm -hmm. and then this you keep it same okay 7 6 15 15. okay this is the first step you're going to do now you have to add it okay let us add that quickly after adding you get this okay so further uh, simplifying uh, uh, 2x plus 3 is equal to 7 and 2y minus uh, 6 plus 2 is equal to 14. Now to get x value 2x is equal to 7 minus 3 which is 4 and this will be uh, 2y minus 4 is equal to 14 and here you get x value as 2 and 2y 
is equal to 18 and y is equal to 9. So I got x value, I got y value. Yes. Let us put this together now. So x plus y is equal to 6. Okay. And yes, sir. x, y is equal to 8. And also pi plus z is equal to is equal to okay. Okay. So now yes, let us solve this. Okay. Now we got z z value, okay, which is zero. Because if you take it to the other side, the z yes, value is zero. Now zero. Yeah. Let us find x plus y whole uh, and x minus y whole square right is equal to minus 4xy okay now okay now let us substitute x plus y that is 6 square minus 4 into 8 okay so we get this as 36, 36. minus 32 which is equal to 4 okay now i yes, got sir. x minus y whole square which is equal to 4 okay now yes, sir. if you remove the uh, square uh, we'll get x is equal to plus or minus y. 2 okay yes, so sir. x x minus y is equal to 2 let us put and x minus y is equal to minus 2. Okay, let us put these two values now. We got these two now. Now let us add these two. So when you add these two, you get uh, x as 4 and y as 2. So for for x as uh, x minus y is equal to two, and x plus y you get x as four and y as two, and for x two uh, minus y is equal to minus two, and x plus y is equal to six. So you get x as two and y as y is four. So here we can write that. Um, either the we can put this together so that x is equal to 4 y is equal to 2 and z is equal to 0 or zero. or x is equal to 2, equal to two y two. is equal to 4 equal to 4 and z is equal, equal to zero. 0 so hence we got the values of x y and Z. Exactly.